Pokemon Grandma on a Saturday. All right, so didn't meet my goal from last Tuesday or Wednesday. I forget which day I mentioned it, but we are not at 100 views, but we are so close, y'all. So close. We're at 94. However, I'm not opening the box until we are past 100, 100 views. So, instead, I have, I do have packs I'm opening. Um, oh, I did research into this MJ Holding Company. So, they do, like, they do a lot of work with, um, collect, like, collectible cards. Um, and, like, getting that out to retails, uh, retail storefronts. Um, they even had like planograms and stuff that I could look up on their website, like how to set it out and all that other stuff. Um, I've seen some videos. I, I really think they're all opinionated, like just opinions in, in the long run about yay or nay on this company. Um, I don't, I don't have too many issues with it. I mean, I think these are, these are fun. Um, it's, you know, when you have a pack like I will be opening two today, uh, the Dollar General or CVS, I forget which one at this point. Uh, this is CVS because this has a foil card. Uh -huh. Yeah. Um, okay. So, and then I've also got a Sword and Shield Chilling Rain pack that we will be opening. The Articuno, uh, the Suian version or whatever, however it's said. Um, but I don't personally have a problem with them because I think they're really fun. Um, the only thing I have a problem with is Dollar General has recently changed their, uh, little selling tactics. Hopefully CVS stays on this path because I will buy them all from CVS if they do. Um, because there's 20 cards versus 10 and it's a guaranteed foil. Whereas it says, look, I know I've nagged on about that for a minute now, but really just chaps my lips, you know? So, anyways, um, and it does, because I've been yabbering on about it. So, anyways, alright, we are gonna go ahead and get this going and see what we get. And with these ones, the foil's usually right on top, so we'll see if that's the case with this one. It is. The foil's right on top. So, um, I have a shiny escape rope. It's a trainer card, which, as you all know, I don't mind a one bit. All right, another trainer card. Cheryl. Alright, I for sure don't have this one, so that's kind of cool. There's quite a few trainer cards, but I don't mind that. Um, this is a supporter trainer. It says Rapid Strike Style Mustard. I don't have this one. Speaking of mustard, though, you guys, I have been on... Is this focusing at all? There. Uh. Um, I've been on a huge mustard kick. Like, I've been looking into different flavors of mustard. Um, I had a corned beef sandwich with mustard relish and some mayo and Havarti cheese. Oh my goodness, y'all. Get some. Seriously, it was so good. Uh, trainer. It's an item. Rapid Strike Scroll of Swirls. Alright, so we have... Uh, four yellow energies. That's, they do that stuff with this pack too, but whatever. Um, oh, so there's two Pokemon in this. Um, I don't know the name of the bird, little bug, bug thing. I don't even know what it is. It's, it's, I think it's electrical to be honest, but I don't know. Um, Rockruff, but like you see the little bird. 
or bug or electric type. I I don't know the name, but that's cool. Um, Mag Cargo. I got a Sawubat. Oh, I like this one um, because it has the um, the fighting type trainer, and I forget her name off the top of my head in the background, but it's got Hitman on top, and there she is in the back. And then I got a Groki. Score Bunny. I like the art on this one. It's very industrial, which fits because it's it's a run. So very cool. Fruit, fruit. I usually when I talk about fruit, fruit, I go fruit, fruit, just like just like in that little cartoon thing. Um, sorry guys, I'm very animated with my, like, uh, onomatopoeia or trying to replicate the noises from the cartoon. Um, Diglett. Alright, we gotta repeat. Boom, boom. Uh, Benipede. A spiel. On spiel day, honestly, guys, I ended up with over 2,000 spiel candies for Pokemon Go. I went really hard on that for no good reason. Um, and then the last card is a Crab Rawler. So, yeah, overall, I would not say that was a horrible pack. And... I think all the cards here were okay. Um, the energies were from 2017. Um, otherwise, it is a pack composed of 2020 and 2021. So, yeah, still, I like it, I think it's cool. Other people on the internet uh, disagree. The one guy was very adamant that if you liked it, then you were an absolute moron. So I guess in his opinion, I am a moron. And I will sip to that. Because <sighs> I don't care. Um, so yeah, and then the other one is the Sword and Shield Chilling Rain. Yeah. And if I have an issue opening this one, which, ow! Mm. I have a hangnail, and that pack just, man, whoo! Almost made me bleed. That's a, mm. All right. Got it. this one because it's got two Pokemon. Sneasel with a bomb of snow in the back. A Galarian Farfetch'd. I'm going to be real honest. Uh, on Pokemon Go, I have two four-star Farfetch'd. I don't know what to do with that. It's like my first double uh, four-star. I really, I, I don't do that. Alright. Venipede. Now they're fruit, fruit. Alright. <gasps> guys, 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 guys!